Hey, and welcome back. Quick update on my rack wireless antenna kit that I ordered just to upgrade my setup right now. Right now I have moved my helium miner from the front of the house to the back of the house and I ordered a kit so I could put a new antenna outside and hopefully get better reception and increase my profitability. So the default one I believe is about 3 dBi. I bought the 5.8 just to give me a nice broader connection to other hotspot miners that are in the area. And I went on the website Black Friday, got a bit of a deal. It was 10% off. That's something, I guess. It's not a huge sale, but it's something. And this is what I paid for everything that I bought if you're interested. So I bought the fiberglass antenna kit for the helium miner. Now this is for the 915 megahertz model, which we use here in North America. I also picked up a pulsar cable. This is just because if I'm installing it close to the roof or at the top of the house, I need enough distance for that cable to come around and inside the house where my miner is going to be. I'm hopefully not going to have it too far apart. And then I also got an adapter just in case I have to snip that cable and put on a new end uh, so we can shorten that distance as much as possible. Anyways, the part of the package just came in. And if you didn't know, if you're ordering from wackwireless.com like I did, uh, you should know that it's coming from China. So it's not coming from anywhere in North America. So it will take some time and it comes in packages. It's not just one big bulk shipment. I guess they're just shipping it as they have it. And so far this package came in and I'll do a quick open box for you. The total of the cost of everything that we have in here, $36 for the kit, $26.10 for the extension cable, $3.60 for the adapter. So the total was $65.70. Shipping was $40 for a grand total of $105. 70. Also, there was some duty. So if you're shipping in from outside or if you're in Canada like me, uh, I'm sure if you're in the US, you also have to pay some sort of duty. For me, it was $24.75 US dollars. That's what it costs just to get it released and into the country. So here's the box that it came in and I first thought it was the antenna. And as you can see, this box was badly damaged. It was tossed around, there's holes and, and there's cracks everywhere. So thank God this is not the antenna. This is just a cable. So I'll just open it up so you can take a quick peek and see what comes inside. So we have just a little bit of packaging. I guess that's to protect whatever's inside. And then we have the cable. So this is the extension cable that I ordered. So anything below 10 meters, you don't lose much for the signal. If you do want to get it to a custom length, they do charge about $6 a meter. That would take an extra 30 days. I wasn't really interested in waiting that long. I just uh, ordered what they had and I have, I have a kit that I can cut them up later. So I have the extra adapters and everything else that I need. So that's it. That's everything that came in the box. I'm just waiting for the actual antenna. So when I finally get that, I'll make an installation video and I'll walk you through that process. Hopefully it won't be too cold outside. I hope you enjoyed the video. This is just a quick update on what's going on with my miner. I'll keep you posted in all other changes. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.